For me, travel umbrellas have always been an item where I'll just take the one that I happen to have, or I'll pick up a cheap one on the road if I need it. However, I ran across this three ounce ultralight travel umbrella by A. Broly last year, so I decided to check it out. The two things that immediately stood out to me with this umbrella are the weight and the price. It's about eight inches or 20 centimeters long by one and a half inches or four centimeters wide. And the best thing is that this thing only weighs three ounces or 87 grams, which is tied with the other brand for the lightest travel umbrella that I could find. It's worth noting that this thing comes in a giant plastic case, which actually weighs more than the umbrella itself. It's handy to use for protecting the umbrella. I'd use it if I was carrying this thing in my car or something, but you definitely don't need the case for travel. So far I've had this umbrella for about five months and I've taken it on several trips. I've taken it hiking to Seattle and then I used it to stand outside in the rain in Quito, Ecuador for over an hour while I was waiting in line for a nativity show. This thing has worked out great for me so far. The only downside being that the canopy is a little bit small compared to other umbrellas, which means if you get stuck in a heavy downpour, it's barely gonna cover you. The way they make this so small and light is by having these carbon fiber ribs with a little hinge in them. So you fold these things all back. So the size of the thing folded is smaller than a regular travel umbrella. This is the umbrella with all the ribs folded back. It's fairly easy to open. If you just kind of give this thing a little shake before you pop it open, you should be able to get it open without having to pop all these ribs out. And as you can see, the canopy is a little bit small, but it is wide enough to cover your entire body. And then to compare that to what I consider to be kind of a more traditionally sized travel umbrella, this is a 36 inch over here compared to the 34 inch A Broly. Definitely has a wider coverage. However, this thing is about seven and a half ounces, 213 grams, so about two and a half times the weight of the A Broly. And so you can see the difference in coverage between a 34 and a 36 inch umbrella. A full size umbrella is more like 38 to 40. This is the A Broly 34, regular mini 36, 34, 36. And then when you're closing this thing, you do have to do the one extra step of flipping down all these ribs. There's really no way to close this thing down without doing that. One of the selling points on this thing is that if you're in heavy winds, these ribs would just flip back so it doesn't damage the umbrella. I tested that out while I was hiking on a windy day and it definitely works. These things are gonna flip back when you hit wind and doesn't damage the umbrella and then you can just flip them right back. As far as price and quality goes, when I was researching umbrellas, the other company that came up as having some of the lightest and highest quality umbrellas was Mont Bell. Their lightest travel umbrella is almost the same size and weight as this one. However, it's almost $70. Well, the A Broly here is only about $26. However, one of the issues that I've found with this umbrella is the availability. They sell it on Amazon, but it's often sold out. It'll be in stock one week and out of stock the next week. However, they do sell it off the A Broly website, which is based out of the UK for 26 pounds, and they do claim to offer free international shipping. One final note on the size and the functionality on this thing, the 34 inch diameter is rather small. So I would consider this to be more of an emergency umbrella, something that's great to keep in your back pocket or to have just in case you get stuck out in the rain. I found this worked great for me for travel because I like having the extra protection of a small umbrella, but it doesn't always rain, so I don't always end up using it. However, if you're expecting a lot of rain or if you're gonna be outside a lot, especially in cold weather, or if you want something that's big enough to cover a large backpack, then you might wanna consider a larger size. The company I mentioned earlier, Mont Bell, has some other great options in different sizes, albeit way more expensive than this one. They make a 38 and a half inch wide trekking umbrella, which is a great size. It's still extremely lightweight, 5.3 ounces or 150 grams, which is about the lightest full size umbrella that I could find. That's all I have for the review on the A Broly Tube Mini Travel Umbrella. Let me know in the comments below if you have any questions or recommendations on other great mini travel umbrellas. And again, thanks for watching.